It's the one and only Pop DiBiase, and I'm with the one and only Pac-Man Jones. How you doing, brother? I'm good. I'm good. Blessed that I'm getting to talk to you right now. Now, Pac-Man, you all here in Vegas right now? You had an illustrious career, went to uh, West Virginia, also was a big baller at the corner position and everything like that. What's your best advice for all these rookies right now, all these guys about to go to the NFL? Well, first, shout out to I'm Athlete. Um, we're doing something special over there. Shout out to B. Marshall. But, um, you know, just enjoy it, man, and, and, and don't take anything for granted and work hard. You know, everything else will pr pr pretty much take care of itself and respect the game. There's always going to be a younger guy behind you that's working his tail off to get to be uh, or, or trying to be where you, where you want to be. Okay, when you look at the defensive back position, the corner position, the position that you played, do you feel like this is possibly the best group in this whole entire draft? I see a lot of studs in this group. I think it's a, a, a corner. This is probably, this will be probably one of the biggest first round group of corners, I think. Um, it's a lot of guys that can play a lot of good football here um, in this draft. and. Two of them has already gone off the board already, which is very early. I think three and four they went. So um, two DNs, two two corners. Um, let's see what five bring. But I, I think this might be a day where six six guys at the cornerback position get called. All right. And so your Cincinnati Bengals, I know that was a team that you wound up pretty much inheriting because you did play on a few teams. But I know Bengals are the most significant for you because your relationship with Marv and everything like that. What do you think about their chances next season? Um, I think it's high. You know, um, they had a hell of a season this year. They um, addressed a lot of key issues on the off seasons. Um, shout out to Believe in the Bengals with Pac-Man Jones and Solomon Wilcox, um, my Believe family over there. But um, they had a good season this year, I think. Um, Mr. Brown made it rain on the off season with the O-line. Um, we're in a good place right now as far as Cincinnati Bengals. Um, like I said, our 22 starters are going to start, but we're, we, we're, it's never enough guys that, that can help us out. So um, eager, excited to see what we do at 31 today. All right, so you heard it from the man himself. He can't wait to see what's going on with that. Thank you so much, Adam. For